morning, Erico. May I introduce you to Anthony Hofer, our newest uh, TFL teacher? Hi, Erico. Uh, this is my friend Anthony. Please introduce uh, him. Yeah. Say hello to him. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Jennifer. May I introduce you to Anthony Hofer? Hello, Anthony. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. And do you know him? <laughs> yes, <laughs> I do. Okay. What they were both doing was introducing me, uh, Tony. And what? Can anyone tell me if they noticed a difference between what Liam was saying and between what Tony was saying? A difference. Oswaldo. Uh, Liam was uh, being more polite. Okay, that's right. Anybody else? He's also being more formal. Okay, that's what I was looking for. More formal. Um, Liam was being introducing me in a formal way, and Tony was doing it in a less formal way. So, there are common phrases for both, and the two are formal and less formal. And when using the formal, we use it in situations that are uh, more formal, so maybe people you don't know, also important people, maybe uh, your elders, teachers, doctors, and less formal would be used with people you know. As you notice, Tony said, uh, this is my friend. We already know each other. So he's just introducing less formally. And so for formal, we'll do a couple examples. Um, there'd be may I present, which is really formal. So maybe that would be like a, a I don't know, teacher or politician or something. And there's also, I would like to introduce you to, okay. and for the less formal side, we have uh, less formally have you met? And also just this is. So does anybody have any questions when to use the formal and less formal? No? Okay. That's good. Um, Liam is going to now take you through our first worksheet. So now, um, Look at the handout that I just gave to you, and uh, we are going to do the fill in the bank using the formal and last formal phrases that we have on the board. Okay. Um, look at number one and number two. We are going to do those two all together. Okay. And uh, let's look at number two. But before before we do that, I would like to ask you if you have uh, any questions. Uh, do you understand what you have to do? Yes. 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 Okay. Uh, let me ask you this: Are you going to do this fill in the blank with a partner? No. no. Very good. No, you are supposed to do this all by your own. And I would like to ask you another question. Uh, are you going to use the formal and less formal phrases to fill in the blank? Yes. 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 Very good. That's right. Okay. So now let's do number one all together. Uh, who wants to do number one? Anyone? Yes. Uh, hey, Joe. Have you met my friend Steve? Very good. Uh, would you please go to the board and, and, and do that? And uh, let me write this one, okay? And uh, yeah, come on up here. Thank you. Uh, 
Ale to bolo som Can you please read it and, and explain to to us why did we choose have you met? This is this is the part that you feel in. Uh, because it's less formal because Joe's my friend and Steve's my friend as well. So I know them very well. Very good. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. You can go back to your seat now. Okay, now for number two. Uh, anyone else wants to uh, volunteer for this one? Jennifer, thank you. Good morning, class. I'd like you to meet our new student, Sarah. That's very good. Okay, please explain to us why did you choose that? I chose that because it's more formal, because it's a new student and no one knows her. Excellent. Very good. Very good, Jennifer. Now, we, uh, we will do number three and number four, okay? So take a few minutes and, and fill in the blank. Okay, in the meantime I'm going to write the number three and number four on the board. Who wants to do number three? Anybody? Oswaldo, please. Um, Mr. Smith, I'd like to introduce you to my father. Yeah, very good. That's the right answer. Uh, please explain to the class why, why did you choose that? Uh, it seems like uh, he's referring to Mr. Smith as Mr., which means that they don't know each other so well. Yeah, very and good. He's also uh, introducing him to his father. You're right. You're his right. Father. Very good. Uh, so the answer here is, I would like to introduce you to to introduce you to my father. Okay. Now number four. Who wants to do that? Vila, please. What's up? Do you know Kate? Very good. What's up? This. It's yeah, right. Kate, can you tell us why? Why you choose that? Because uh, my friend and I know them. It's very informal. I try to. Yeah. To what's up? To my friend, what's up? Yeah, yeah that's right. And also sometimes we use what's up, dude. Yeah, that's oh, not okay. <laughs> even more, <laughs> more more friendly. Okay, so. The answer to this one is, do you know? Okay. Um, now, after after this, we are going to do another activity, and uh, Tony will be doing the next the next one. Thank you. Uh, thank you for introducing me, Olivia. Uh, uh, hey, hello. I'm, uh, we are going to do a role playing activity. Uh, we, uh, I'm going to have three students come up and I will give you each card. On that card, it will be your name and who you are. For example, and this is uh, Joel's brother. Uh, Jeff is a uh, Joel, uh, Joel's brother, and and then uh, all you have to do is uh, you have, uh, you just introduce each other 
the using formal and informal phrase uh, depending on the card. Now let three victims come up. And, oh, no, 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 no. I mean three volunteers. <laughs> oh, Oswaldo, you are lucky. <laughs> and, and you are lucky too. <laughs> Oh, Krishna, you are also lucky. What's one of you want to be a husband? My name is Dave James. And, and you want to be a wife? My name is Harry. And Krishna, you want to be a neighbor friend. And you know each uh, you are the, uh, spouse, and you are going to introduce to her, your new neighbor. She please come to your new neighbor houses. Okay, let's begin. Hi, Fred. I'd like you to meet my husband. James. Hi, James. Nice to meet you. Hello, friend. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Welcome to the neighborhood. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Good job. Yeah. You are awesome. Yeah. And then, could you uh, go back to your seat? Yes. Yeah. Okay. 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 So now, we have uh, three more uh, victims. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, three lucky stuff here. Please come up. Jennifer, you are pretty. <laughs> and um, Momoko, you are also lucky too. Yes. <laughs> and Bella, you are also beautiful. <laughs> people uh, but they don't know each other and all you have to do is just to interest you and uh, those brother deaf together they don't know each other Okay, um, well, today we learned about the formal and less formal and the situations when to use them. And you all did great today. Class dismissed. Yeah. <laughs>